Hello everyone, welcome back to the nursery. Guys, here's Miss Li little Miss Lillian. She's ready. Look at this. Isn't she pretty? I'll show you her little shoes. She's got on a little dress. It's Precious Moments dress. Now, she does have three-quarter limbs, guys. I had to uh, put her a shirt under this, but now you could do a short sleeve, too, you know, as long as it covers her, her little arms. Uh, and there she is. Let me turn around so you can see her. Isn't she beautiful? Gosh, guys, she's gorgeous. She turned out better than I anticipated. I mean, she's she's pretty. She's just pretty. That's all you can say. Now, her hair is still wet. I just sent her mama, Julie, some pictures of her. And her hair is still wet, mama. This is Julie's baby over at the, um, the bunny cottage. Sorry, guys. I lost it there for just a minute. But it's, she's over at the Bunny Cottage. Everybody go over and subscribe to her, guys, if you want to follow this baby. I will be sending her out. I was going to tomorrow, but I think it'll be Saturday. Uh, my husband has a doctor's appointment tomorrow. He's not been doing good. Um, yeah, we've just been having a lot of troubles lately, guys. But I finally got this baby ready for Miss Julie. She's been really patient with me. And I thank you so much, honey. Um, but actually it didn't take me as long as I thought it would. As big as she is, she's a big baby. She is 22 inches long. And Julie, I was telling you for your references, she is 22 inches long and she weighs seven and a half pounds. And, um, so I just wanted you to know how much she weighed and all that. She has a beautiful, beautiful, um, like maybe a peaches and cream skin tone. Very gorgeous. She has medium brown hair, which the mommy picked out. She's got baby brown eyes. And she's absolutely a beauty. Uh, let me let me go down, pan down. Let's, I, I put her dress out now so you can see it. See her little dress? If I can, I'll show you right over here. Now, she won't go home in this, but I will send it. It's a little precious moment embroidered. Her little shoes, if I can get them in the frame. There, you can see the tops of them. They're little black. Just little black, black, really soft shoes in the embroidery on top of them, little hearts and stuff. It's embroidered in a like, very pale pink. And then on the sides over here is a black sash, like a black bow, not a sash, a bow, on the sides where it Velcro's at. I'll hold it up so you can see that. See? And then the tops has got that. She's got little uh, pink turned down cuff socks. There's that dress. See that? Isn't that gorgeous? Now, it didn't come with bloomers with it, but I did find these in my closet, and I put them under it. It's perfect color pink to match this, and uh, I put it in, uh, put them on her to cover up her leg, because uh, she is three-quarter limb, like I say, and I will be doing her box packing very, very, very soon, um, and she'll be going out. Uh, yeah, she's she turned out better than I expected, guys, honestly. She turned out really beautiful. She's something else. God, I'm pretty sure. I hope she loves her, but I'm pretty sure she will. Because I'm telling you guys, this is one gorgeous, beautiful baby. I left her eyelashes slightly longer. Because I wanted her to have those big, long, beautiful eyelashes. And they are rooted. Uh, her hair was rooted by me, and she was painted by me. Her hair is Slumberland Mohair. And it is in the wavy and in a medium brown. And guys, if you want to in this, I prefer it curly. I do all mine this way with a curly look. I love that curly hair. But if you like, you can just wet it down a little bit and just comb it down, let it let it dry that way, and it'll it'll go mostly straight. Now, not completely. It'll never be completely straight, but it will go mostly straight. And you can leave it dry like that and it'll stay that way. But I like the curly look. Um let me see if I can turn around and you can see the back. I want you her to see the back of the hair, too. There we go. Look at that. Isn't that pretty? And her little dress ties in the back with a pink bow. See? Isn't she a beauty? Say hi, Mama. Say hi, Mama. I'll be home soon. Love you. Mwah. Mwah. <laughs> she give Mama big kisses. And she says, I'll be home soon, Mama. I'll be coming. Just any day now. I don't know. I may just... If I can get back from the doctor in time from the post office to send her, I might put her in the mail tomorrow. If not, she'll go off Saturday for sure. Absolutely sure on Saturday. But um, 
yeah, I just wanted everybody to see her. Um, and remember, if you want to follow this baby now, guys, go over and, um, and subscribe to the Bunny Cottages channel. Her name's Julie. Guys, she is a wonderful, wonderful person. She used to be, uh, I think she retired now, but she was a policeman. Well, I can't say policeman. A police woman. Sorry about that, Julie. Um, yeah, she done that, and uh, I think she's retired now, and she's just, she is a very nice, sweet lady, guys. Just go and subscribe to her. She's, she's great. She's a really nice, wonderful person. If you want to follow her, she'll have this baby on there, too. And she's got other babies, too. They're very beautiful, beautiful babies. So, Julie, there's your baby. I hope you love her. I sure do. If you don't want her, I'll take her. <laughs> I'm just kidding, Julie. Uh, but, uh, yeah, I know you'll want her because she's gorgeous. I don't know who would want her. She's beautiful. Like I say, her hair is still a little wet right now. I just, I just um, styled it. I wet it down and style it and leave it curly, and then I'll... Uh, when it dries, I kind of fluff out the ends, you know, to take away that wet look. And, uh, yeah, I just love her. She's gorgeous. But I'll be sending her home with some goodies, and I'm not going to show the goodies. Because I want her mama to be surprised. I've got her several goodies here. For one thing, she will be coming with this beautiful dress and these little turned-down socks and these little shoes and the headband. But I will, I, I will put her in a sleeper, Julie, to send her home. And it's a real cute little pink sleeper. And I've got you some other clothes, too, for her and little things. So, um, yeah. So, when you get her, you can do a solid box opening. And we'll I'll pop over there on there and see that box opening for that baby. Yeah. So, anyway, guys, there she is. Guys, I, I do these babies all the time. If you're interested in anything like this, just let me know. Um, this is my paint. I do this, too, to show, you know, to show people my work. I try very hard, guys, on these babies to make them be each and every one beautiful. And so far, I've had no complaints. So, uh, if anybody's interested, you just let me know. I do. I also carry layaway on them. So, uh, every way, a payment plan. So, every, that way, everybody can, if they want a baby, they can have a chance to have one. And, uh, yeah, I ask that you pay. Um, usually, I get a $100 deposit. And, uh... Guys, what I do with that deposit is, all I do with that deposit is, is I buy the kit, whatever, whatever kit that your baby that you're wanting. I take that first. I don't get paid anything uh, at first. I take that hundred and I buy your kit and your supplies if it'll buy them all. Now, depending on the kit, sometimes a hundred won't buy all the supplies, but at least it does help me out to buy the supplies. And uh, so first thing I start off on buying, first thing is when the first money comes in to me from layaway, if anybody does layaway and does a deposit, it goes towards buying the kit, first thing. That way I can get started on at least painting it. And then from there out, I go with what money I get from there on out. I start buying up the rest of the supplies every month when I'm paid. I buy their, like their body, their hair, their eyes, whatever else I need. And then after I get all that done, that's when I start getting paid a little bit of money. But I do all that first. So that's the reason I asked for a $100 deposit, guys. Uh, I will tell you my disclaimer on them is um, um, you pay a $100 deposit. That ensures you're going to take that baby and will hold that baby for you. Or if I have one, you know, that I'm just making and putting up for sale. And then um, I will tell you about my layaway plan. Uh, you can pay me a $100 deposit and then you can pay whatever you can afford uh, after that from then on out every month. Uh, just whatever you can afford to get the baby paid off, and then I will send it to you. Um, and my policy is there is no returns and there are no refunds. So if you, um, like if you place a, a $100 deposit on a baby, and I go ahead and buy that kit and get started painting and everything else, and then a month later, you say, well, I don't want it. I want another one. The money you paid me is non-refundable. So, I do want to make that disclaimer on there and let everybody know how my policies work. And there are um, no returns. Unless, guys, now, if there was something major wrong with the baby, when it came to you, just whenever you first got it, then, yes, you know, you could send it back to me and then I would refund your money. But I'm telling you, I pack these babies so well in shipping 
they are really well packed and they're you know there's not anything going to happen to me shipping believe me i even put them down inside of a bar garbage bag uh the whole thing clothes and all uh inside of a big garbage bag so that uh in case they run into rain or something you know so these babies are not they're not anything going to happen to them believe me so uh but yeah that's my policy guys no refunds no returns so be sure that it's the baby you want when you order it and uh yeah and then i guess that's about it so if anybody's interested you let me know i'll start working on a baby for you i got another one now that i'm going to start well i've got her about halfway finished that is the Skya Awake. I'll update you on her next because that's who I'm working on. And then, of course, I'm going to be working on Haley for my very, very nice, wonderful, sweet friend. Um, I haven't got to her baby yet, and she's been so patient with me and let me get all these other babies done before hers. And actually, she was in line before me. She told me I could even wait to win her if I needed to. So um, I call her my sweet or my angel. And she knows who she is, so when you see this, my sweet, uh, your baby's getting worked on just next. I'm going to work on Skya and Haley. I'm also working on the two um, reasonably reborns, guys, that I'll have up for sale. Uh, if you're interested in it, buying any either of those two, you just message me. I do carry that way on those also. And um, you just pay me down a deposit and whatever you can afford. And they are half the price of my regular dolls. Um, they're going to run, now like my regular dolls, like this one, if, say for instance, we traded, right? Julie and I traded on this baby. This was a trade baby. But if I had made this for her and sold it to her, I, this baby would have cost 600 plus shipping. That's how much this baby would have cost. But on my reasonable reborns, guys, they're going to be half that. They're going to be 300 plus shipping. Now, all of my dolls don't run that. 600. Uh, most of them do if they're completed by me with the hire and everything. They run around 600. Unless you're talking about a big toddler. And if you're talking about a big toddler, they go for more. But like a, you know, this size and lower. Newborns or whatever. They run 600. And um, then, you know, but like I said, the reasonable rewards I'm working on is 300 plus shipping. The only difference is, is they will not have mohair. They will either be bald or have lightly painted hair. Uh, they won't come with a big wardrobe like I send home with these guys. And uh, they will have the uh, polyglass eyes, acrylic like eyes, I guess what you call it, polyglass, instead of real glass eyes. They'll have the polyglass eyes. So, yeah. So if anybody's interested, let me know. And Julie, thank you so much for doing the trade with me. It was really fun between you and I. Um, she sent me a little baby, and then I'm saying made this one. I custom made this one for her, and I'm sending it to her. So I hope you enjoy yourself very much, Julie. I, honestly, the the pictures and the video don't do her justice. She is beautiful. Turned out great. I couldn't have asked for. I couldn't have imagined her to look any better than what she does. She is really, really, really nice. Okay. Guys, that's it. Thank you so much for watching. I appreciate each and every one of you. Oh, yeah. And the other lady that got the giveaway, she did claim her baby. So, I'll be shipping that Saturday, too, as well. So, i just letting guys, everybody know. Yes, she did claim her baby. The giveaway baby. Okay, guys, that's it. And I'll talk to you soon in a video. Thank you so much for watching. Bye-bye.